Every spore syringe is going to appear differently based on the vendor who sold it and who possibly filled it and based on the manufacturer of the syringe. So for example, this syringe right here was sold as a 10cc spore syringe. And because the manufacturer did not label the syringe fully, the vendor sold it as a 10cc spore syringe. This spore syringe right here is filled to the top and it is filled at exactly 10 cc's or 10 milliliters of spore solution. So it all depends on the vendor and the syringe manufacturer on what your actual syringes are going to look like. Whenever you're reading a syringe, if you didn't know, you want to go off of the second black ring here on the plunger. So once you get down to actually using your measurement lines, you want half of a cc to three quarters of a cc. In reality, you really only need a drop of spore solution in order to get enough spores to germinate in meat in order to grow the mushroom mycelium.